like Bambi. You have no hairs anymore. <sighs> oh, Sebastian's awake. Time to get up. Good morning, guys. Quickly let Pippa out before we go get the baby. I think I might need to get her like a little coat. It's freezing out here. Is that better? Is that better? It's nice and warm in here. Good morning, guys. <laughs> Can mommy have a kiss? Mwah, I missed you. I missed you. You missed me too? Oh. Daddy brought in more toys. Yeah. So it's like Christmas again in our house for a bash because my mother-in-law is staying the night with us tonight and um, we've been keeping a lot of Bash's toys in the guest room because he just has way too many and we had to take some of them out so that she could sleep comfortably in there and so now he gets to play with like all of the toys that he hasn't seen in a couple months. So usually, um, especially during football season, Brandon brings home breakfast, but football just ended and they were still doing breakfast, but I guess like a pipe burst nearby and the kitchen had to close. So now I have to actually be a mom and find out what my child is gonna eat for breakfast. And I think he's gonna get oatmeal just because it's very quick, it's already 8.30, but I may make waffles in a little bit too because I'm actually really hungry. Scratch that. Bash is gonna eat oatmeal and I'm just gonna eat cereal. And if you're wondering why his is on a plate, this is a trick my mom taught me. Actually, she did this with me when I was a kid. You you know, make it in a bowl, but then serve it on a plate and eat from the outsides. And then you never bring your mouth ever. And you don't have to wait on your food. It's just nice and cool already. Uh, so, uh, I don't know if you can hear it, but Bash is laying here in my bed watching Toy Story. Pippa is destroying a toy. We just got back in the bed because it's hard for me to be anywhere that's not comfortable anymore and I need to finish editing um, today's video that's gonna go up on my channel it's Bash's um, two and a half year update Pippa calm down <laughs> um, it's actually completely edited I just need to fill in like my description box with links and stuff for you guys but anyway I'm gonna sit here and do that Brennan just left for work to go deal with like the whole issue with the pipe bursting um, he was supposed to be off today, so every now that the season's over, until he has to go do Super Bowl um, logistics again this year, um, he's off Thursday and Fridays. But since this happened and he runs the um, practice facility for the team, um, he has to go in and kind of deal with this. But he should be back in like an hour and a half, which is nice. And I know that that's like super helpful for me because getting like the, to the end of the pregnancy, I'm super tired all the time. And um, so just having that like extra hand here during the day is going to be so awesome. And then, but it's short lived because like I said, he's going to go help with Super Bowl, which is in Miami this year. Last year he did it, but they played here in Atlanta, which was perfect because he was home, but I wasn't pregnant. So it didn't matter. So basically for the final two weeks of my pregnancy, he will be a little bit absent. <laughs> and uh, I don't know how I'm going to deal with that, but I guess when the time comes, we'll take it head on. But anyway, I'm about to do this video and... I just need to get it done now while it's still morning. So it's 11.33 and Brandon ordered me some lunch. This is the Tacos Loco salad from Tacos and Tequilas, which has been like my biggest craving my whole pregnancy. Not specifically this, but just Tacos and Tequilas in general. I've been eating everything from there. Also, my mother-in-law just got here. <laughs> And um, she's staying the night because later today, Brandon and I have to go to our hospital tour and she's gonna watch Bash for us while we go. So I'm just gonna sit here and eat this and hang out with her and Brandon for a little while. Is this the coat? Uh -huh. 
she bought me a winter coat because she knew I didn't have one that fits. So this is nice. I love the color. It's from Neiman Marcus. It's gorgeous. I can't wait to try that on. I just added the meat over and the queso that comes with it. And then I also ordered a second queso for the chips and this has jalapeno in it. All right, so I am out of the bathtub, which lately I've only been taking baths because standing up in the shower is, it's just tiresome and I can't reach everything like I used to be able to. So <laughs> I get in the bathtub just about every single day now, but uh, I'm out, I've done my hair and my makeup uh, so that when we go later, I'll be ready then. My mother-in-law is downstairs with Bash and Brandon still, and I've just been listening to a couple podcasts and I wanted to talk about these for a second. It's not sponsorship, I'm just telling you, but Brandon bought me these um, AirPod Pros for Christmas and they are the best thing ever if you are blow drying your hair because they're noise canceling. And I'm not sure if the other AirPods that originally came out are noise canceling, but these are. So when I put them in my ears and then put my podcast on or music or whatever, I can't hear, I can barely hear my blow dryer. So they are a little pricey, but maybe if you have a birthday coming up or next Christmas or whatever, consider getting them because I love it. I, I mean, you can do everything in them now in loud noises, especially like if you work in an office environment or something, I would have loved these back in the day when I had a little cubicle at, <laughs> at my old job, my old, old job. But anyway, I'm gonna throw some clothes on and um, go down and see what everybody else is up to. <laughs> So today's outfit is an all black number, basically to hide all of these braces that I have on. So right now I'm wearing this new pregnancy support belt and I had to order it at the recommendation of my doctor because Margot is sitting so low in my pelvis that she can cause back problems at this point and I still have about a month to go. So yeah, here's my new belly brace. And it does feel like she's sitting a lot higher now. I do feel supported. And then you may have noticed this lovely thing, and that is because I developed carpal tunnel. I don't know why. I don't know if it's the weight gain or what, but either way, I have pregnancy um, induced or related carpal tunnel, so I have to wear the brace now. And a lot of you may remember that I also have a knee brace, but I refuse to put all three on at the same time. I'm feeling totally geriatric at the moment, but <laughs> whatever. Uh, we finally ventured out of the house for the day. It is what time? Like almost four. And we're on our way to our hospital tour um, because I am giving birth at a different hospital. Turn this way, yeah. I'm giving birth at a different hospital this time than I did last time since we moved. It's the like sister hospital of the hospital in Atlanta, but further north. And so they like supposedly redid their women's center and all this stuff. Uh oh, why is it like, oh, I'm getting the sun glare. There we go. They supposedly redid their women's center and all of that. I don't know when, but recently or not too long ago. So it's supposed to be really nice. This angle is not flattering. Oh well. And um, another cool thing about going on our tour today is that Gabby, who you guys, if you've been watching the vlogs for a minute, my neighbor right next door, they coincidentally scheduled their hospital tour today too and she's giving birth at the same place so we'll all be there together which is really fun i'm just excited because this is like just another step to baby girl being here and uh, this is always like fun like some of the fun stuff of having a baby we just got to the hospital but i wanted to show you this spiffy little ride we took brennan's mom's two-seater on the way here and i could barely fit in it <laughs> i'm too pregnant pretty soon we're gonna be making this walk in here to have our baby. It'll be a slow walk. A slow walk. <laughs> 
So this is the women's center. And my OB's office is right there. Oh, I'm having Braxton Hicks already. Oh, man. No, I left it in the car because I didn't want to have to go while we were in here. It's so cute in here. It's really nice. One thing I didn't take into consideration with this band and belt thing is my leggings are all the way up to here because it's the over the belly kind. I had to take the whole thing completely off just to use the bathroom just now. And that was a pain. So keep in mind, if you get one of these, it's not fun. Like <laughs> Gabby's here. <laughs> and that's her husband and Haley and Brandon leaving the Pregos behind. <laughs> sitting over here this room is huge this is the postpartum room we ordered dinner from O Charlie's have not been there in forever my mother-in-law got a burger bash has fries and shrimp I have a filet mignon which is in here and then I don't know what Brandon ordered. He has the Nashville hot burger or sandwich. And that thing is huge. Mm. Everybody just finished eating. Nine. I didn't show any of it on camera just because we were talking and stuff. Um, the hospital tour was really nice. We, um, I couldn't film as much as I thought I could. Like she didn't mind that I filmed, but she just wanted like to make sure like other people didn't care. So. I, she let me film the rooms like when people weren't in them. So I just basically waited so that you guys could see them till everybody walked out. And then she said, I can just turn around and film the rooms, which was nice. And then at the end of it, we pre-registered. I had just hadn't gotten around to doing it yet. And I have the forms here at the house, but still just never did anything with them. So we filled them out and gave them to admissions while we were there. Hey baby. Mommy. Yes, baby. Yes. And then um, we left and came here and um, got food. I got him. <laughs> Can you say hi? <laughs> Bash, I don't have you. You're going to fall. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. <laughs> no, I'm not. Oh, you're sitting down. Okay. There you go. Big boy. Put your chair close to mine. Big boy. You, go. you going night-night? night-night. Yeah, you're going night-night. Good night, I love you. Anyway, um, we're about to push. Yeah, he can get down. Here, pop down, there you go. We're about to put Bash down for bed and then um, I'm gonna have like a little piece of pie in bed. And then I think, what time is it, Brandon? Oh, I have the phone. Oh, it's only 7.40, I thought it was later. Dang, I was ready to go to sleep. <laughs> But uh, maybe we might turn on the new live action Aladdin because they added it to Disney Plus. And I haven't seen it yet. I'm so sleepy though. And I'm just having Braxton Hicks like every hour. It is now 10.38. I got my pie and my ice cream and my extra blanket on the bed because this thing is so cozy. It's not cute, but keeps me warm at night. Pippa has already fallen asleep and Brandon is laying here in the bed next to me reading a book. I am exhausted. My head is throbbing. I developed a headache earlier like this evening on the way back from the hospital and it's just got progressively worse and I took something and it didn't take the headache away. So I'm just gonna try to sleep it off. But anyway, I hope that you enjoyed this vlog. A lot of you guys were asking for the vlog, saying you miss the old vlogs. And so I felt like today would be a great day to just turn my camera on and film. I really hope that you guys like this video. If you did, get, please give it a thumbs up. And if you aren't subscribed to my channel, please go ahead and do that and share it because I would love to have even more of you guys are part of my YouTube family, especially now that our family is growing. So 
Anyway, we are in bed. I'm gonna turn the TV on and probably fall asleep to whatever we put on. I don't know if we're gonna make Aladdin tonight <laughs> because we're both exhausted. But anyway, I will see you guys in my next video. Good night.